Hey guys, what's up? It's JR Cuber. In this video, we have another unboxing from the cubicle. In here should be the new Wuxia and Wuxia M from Chi. So let's go ahead and open it up. All right, so we've got two boxes. And yep. So yeah, as you can see, we've got the Wuxia and the Wuxia M. It looks like we've also got something written down here. I don't know what that means exactly, but I guess we will find out. So let's go ahead and start with this one. Um, so this one is stickerless. I'm wondering if the other one is black, probably. Um, so this one, I guess, would be the standard one. Okay. So, cool, here we go. Huh, very interesting. So, I mean, I don't really keep up with 2x2s, two two, so a lot of newer 2x2s two two I don't have. Um, and I still use a Lingpo because I just haven't bothered to, um, you know, set up any other decent cube. Uh, I was using the Jing Hen M from the Cubicle Labs for a while, but I actually, I just don't like that puzzle really. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. This puzzle feels pretty good though. It's really, really smooth. So it's really silky and smooth. It um, doesn't feel bumpy at all. It's just, it deforms a lot. So it, it just kind of feels really loose and flimsy and floppy. Huh. The turning feels nice, but I just, it doesn't seem like I can move very quick with this puzzle. So yeah, if you guys haven't heard about the uh, Wuxia 2x2, basically it's just the 2x2 in the Wu line of puzzles from Qi. So that line includes the Wu Chui, the Wu Shuang, the Wu Ji, the Wu Hua. Um, so, which are all like big cubes basically. So this is the first like smaller cube, like a 2x2. Um, and the 3x3 in that line, they don't have like a Wu 3x3, um, but they do have the Volk 3, which is like their flagship 3x3. So. Uh, at this point now, they kind of have a full line of puzzles, basically. Um, yeah, but this 2x2 two two feels pretty good. I'm, I'm really curious to see how um, the magnetic one is in comparison. So I was right, this one is black. Um, so yeah, this one comes man uh, this one comes magnetic from the factory, I'm quite sure. So let's just go ahead and try out this one. Yeah, so basically the same feeling. Um, yeah, I... The magnets, they help a bit, I would say. Yeah, it, it feels a little bit more stable, but the magnets aren't very strong at all. Like, they're really, really light magnets. Yeah, this one, it feels a little bit better, but it's also, it just doesn't feel all that fast. You know, it feels a little bit sluggish. You know, I'm sure with some setting up, that would get a lot better, but what did I just do? <laughs> Still, that's not the greatest first impression. Um, so yeah, I would have to see how this puzzle would get with some lubrication. It does feel like it's been lubricated, almost a little bit over lubricated. But yeah, the puzzle feels okay. I mean, um, corner cutting... It can't quite do 45, so at 45 it struggles quite a bit. But, um, yeah, that could just be tensioning. I don't know. Reverse also feels pretty much normal for a 2x2, so... Yeah, these these feel like pretty alright cubes. I don't really know what the standard for 2x2 two two is. I, you know, I'm not... I don't have that many 2x2s, two so... Yeah, I'm not really sure what I can say about these puzzles. I don't speed solve 2x2, two two, I just kind of can solve the puzzle in a relatively fast amount of time, I guess. You know, I'm like sub 5 on 2x2, two two, but... Um, yeah, this... It, you know, it's a decent puzzle. I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't really know what else to say about these cubes. Um, they do look really nice. I really like these stickerless shades. Um, and it feels good, so the feeling is definitely really nice. I really, really like this smooth feeling. Um, very, very nice to use. But I just don't know how good it's going to be for speed solving. I've always found 2x2s two to just be kind of awkward to handle. I don't know why. Something about it. They just always seem like I can't really turn them very well. It's pretty weird. But yeah, that's pretty much all I can say on the Chi Wuxia 2x2s. I might review these puzzles if you guys really want me to. I, I don't think I will though, but um, 
yeah, it's possible, I guess. I haven't reviewed a 2x2 in many years, um, so maybe I will just to kind of give it a shot again. Anyways, that's about it for this unboxing. Thanks to the Cubicle for making this video possible. I'll leave the links to both of these puzzles down in the description below as always. And yeah, that's about all I can say in this unboxing for the Chi, Wuxia, and Wuxia M. If you guys like this video, make sure you have a like. Links to all of my social media pages, my Patreon, and my merch store are all linked down in the description below as always. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.